I got a very musical family. Like, if you ever met my mama, she sings everything. Like, even if we were, even if we were at like a family event and we were getting ready to leave, she'd be like, "Let's go, let's go." Like, that's just, that's the type of person. Yeah, she sings everything. So like, she really, she really like is the main reason why I found out I could sing because she sang everything. And I got in show choir in my in seventh grade, and it was huge for me because when I got to high school, freshmen couldn't do show choir. And I, I got a chance to audition. And when I auditioned, she loved me. She was like, yeah, I want you to be in show choir. Girl, I'm in love with you. And this ain't the honeymoon. We've passed the infatuation phase. One of the coaches on the football team, he was a choir director. And he heard me singing in the locker room. I was all like, that's you with that voice? So like, yeah, look, got a little voice. He was all like, we got practice tomorrow at the school. You should come. And I was like, all right. You made your mistakes, and we both still have room left to grow. And though love sometimes hurt, I still put you first, and we'll make this thing work. And I think we should take it slow. We're just ordinary people. Like I say, it helped me find my voice when I'm in singing. And now I'm not a part of any choirs. I just like singing for fun. Your dad played at Texas in college and then played for the Packers. And then and you kind of picked up on the football side of things too. But even the fact that like your high school coach was the choir director, you know, it's so fun that you have this football side of you. And then um, this guy that has this amazing voice too. There's other things in life outside of football. So when I'm on the field, I give it 100% of my attention, but when I'm off the field, I have other I have other things I like to partake in. Coming here, I have to find my purpose on the team. Even young, I, like I'm used to being a superstar of the team. And when I came here, I was like freshman, 17 years old. I like, I'm not on the field as much as I wanted to. But, um, you know, coaches kept talking to me. I kept talking to coaches, trying to figure out how I can get better, how I can help on the team. And, you know, they told me to just motivate positivity, like keep up in the locker room with positivity, like it can help. And that's what I did. And I just kept, and I just kept doing that. You know, people who were struggling, I tried my hardest to help them. And even outside of the, like off the field, you know, I try to build relationships with them. So it's not just football. Winning is, winning is nice. Winning is very fun. But it's just, it's a different vibe in the locker room. It's, it's a lot of happiness. Everybody's happy. Everybody's like competing. It's like, it's, it's a family. Like people who, like last year, people who didn't talk to each other, they talk to each other a lot now. And it's, it's not, it's like, our motto last year would always be like big to a champ, so like national champions, like you know stuff like that. It's not like that. It's just like now we break it out like family, love, and it's like I like it. It's just it feels more like a brotherhood than a team. A lot to sing about this season. Oh yeah, yeah, it's a lot. I love it.